Yesterday we went shopping and I'm going shopping again today. <laughs> you know why? Because I found some of the 2021 Lego sets that aren't supposed to be released until January 1st on the shelves at Mastermind Toys. I only went to one Mastermind Toys here in Edmonton and there's two more. So I plan on hitting up the other two today. This is what I found yesterday. It's the X-Wing. Pretty awesome. You get uh, some great minifigures in there, including this one, which is uh, Dodonna, who is actually, uh, that's his first appearance in this set, which is pretty neat. Also, we got Spider-Man, uh, Ghost Rider, and Carnage in this set, and this cool sports car. Uh, there's a few other sets that I had in mind that I want to get, so without further ado, let's head on out and do some Lego shopping. Two for two days. <laughs> I don't know, it's crazy. But then on January 1st, we'll be going to the Lego store too, right? Because the new modular building comes out, so that's pretty epic. But I gotta head out. I gotta go to those other masterminds and check it out, without question. Let's go. Stop number one is another mastermind toys. Here in the uh, Ninjago section. That's right beside the Star Wars section and take a look at what we found. Nice, the Micro Fighter Millennium Falcon. Epic. Also up here, we got the Mickey Mouse art. I think I'm gonna pass on the Mickey Mouse art for now. And we have some more of those uh, Harry Potter textbooks. Found those yesterday, just, I don't think I'm gonna get them, honestly, I don't. And then of course we have the uh, new Spider-Man set as well. This is a huge score though, that's cool. Oh, look, right down here, it's the new Jeep. Jeep Wrangler Technic set. Yesterday we saw the Ferrari and the McLaren. And also we got some of the monster truck ones here as well. Hey, that's pretty cool. And in the city department, I think I've seen something new as well. Yeah, which is this right here. This is the family house. That's a new set for 2021. Ooh. Cool, I'm gonna get that. That's the car transporter. That'll look really good in the city. That's three, 342 pieces, uh, 39.99 Canadian. I don't have a car transporter and that'll look fresh in the Lego city. So we're definitely gonna get that. Oh, and there's the new road plates. Oh my gosh. We better get a new road plate and see what that's all about. I guess I'll get one of those. Sounds good to me. Oh, there's the tractor. That's new as well. Hmm, interesting. I don't think I'm gonna get that. I think this new, this is a new police boat here. Look, the boat floats. That's the new police boat in the Lego City lineup as well. Same with the skate park, that's new for 2021. And this up here as well, the town center. Is that new? I think it is. It's not really like a cohesive set that I'd be looking for. I definitely think that's new because it has the new road plate in the top right corner. What I was really looking for was the best car armor. That's the new Mandalorian set and I don't see it here, unfortunately. There's also the new Spider-Man Miles Morales mech armor and also the Captain America one as well. I haven't seen these before, they're like giant Mandalorian minifigure keychains. Pretty neat, I just confirmed with the lady at the cash counter that everything that they have is out. So there's purchase number one from Mastermind Toys number one. Well, I guess Mastermind Toys number two, if you factor into the one that we went yesterday. Uh, there's one more in town here. I think I'm gonna go check it out. I might luck out. There's our second stop, Mastermind Toys, number two. There's actually one other store in the same vicinity in which you would never expect, but it actually has a huge selection of Lego. Let's start here though. All right, so just like the other stores, they got Mickey and also Harry Potter art. They got the off-road buggy, the Jeep Wrangler, Harry Potter textbooks, the monster trucks, Nothing Star Wars, no Beskar armor, but check it out. Boom, the Spring Lantern Festival. This does not come out until the 10th of January. 
This thing actually looks pretty cool. It's a base plate and a half, 1,793 pieces, comes with a whack of minifigures and some really cool uh, pieces including the light brick and much much more. This thing looks amazing. I'm actually so pumped that this is here right now and we're definitely going to get it. Like this is really early. January 10th? That's crazy. It's the 23rd of December. 17 days early. We're getting it. Besides that they had a bunch of the city stuff that's the same as the other Mastermind toys in which we started at and nothing else new but this is crazy i can't believe they already have this on the shelf it's wild something else that they have is this right here this is actually the three-in-one creator once again not supposed to be out yet and it's on the shelf you can create three different scenes so this beach house right here and this little lighthouse i guess with a little boat and this little scene right here i think i'm gonna leave this one although that beach house would look killer on the beach wouldn't it uh, I think I'm going to leave this one for getting it from the Lego store on January 1st because then we'll get our uh, VIP points. And I don't foresee that being hard to find, but this is awesome. Hey, look, as I'm checking out, guess what they have right here? Minifig Series 21. No way. Oh, there's so many great figs in here. You're welcome. You know what, but due to restrictions, unfortunately, I'm not going to feel out those bags and find the ones we want. So now I find myself at Canadian Tire looking for some of the new Star Wars sets. So here at Canadian Tire, they've got some pretty cool stuff in their surprisingly humongous Lego department, including this life-size Darth Vader on sale. I don't know if they're like Mastermind Toys and get some of the new releases early. However, it does seem like they might be having some stock problems here at this store. This is where the Star Wars stuff is. And that's a negative, folks. I do not see any of the new sets. They do have this really cool Oilers hockey player sculpture, though. So no luck here at Canadian Tire, a store here in Canada that sells practically anything. Oh, well. Wow, 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 wow. Mastermind Toys, 2021 sets. They're hooking it up. Uh, I know some people uh, went to Kohl's in the States and they got some of the stuff uh, there early as well. And here I am at Mastermind Toys and I'm, I'm happy that they did it here in Canada too. I guess if they don't have an instructed release date, if they have the stock, they're gonna put it on the shelf and they're gonna try and sell it, which makes sense to me. So you saw what we got last time or yesterday. And this is what we got today. So we got the uh, Han Solo Micro Fighter. Looks pretty awesome. It's my first Micro Millennium Falcon, which is pretty sweet. Got these new road plates. We're gonna crack those open, do a review on them, test it, see if we can make some curved plates, see what they're good for, see what's going down with these, integrate them here into the Lego City. Also, I got this car transporter, Lego City lineup. I don't have anything to haul the vehicles. What if, what if there's some cars that are busted or broken down they gotta haul them out of there or maybe their new car is coming to a lot or something in the future the lego city and then we got the spring lantern festival which looks epic i can't wait to build this we're going to build this one before we build any of these besides the x-wing we're building that today but we're going to build this one straight away and get a review up on that right away and integrate it somewhere here into the lego city where i don't know it's a base plate and a half It'd look good somewhere in here probably Somewhere in the downtown core, it's going to look fresh. It's going to look like a nice little uh, Chinatown or something like that. It's going to look fantastic, so I can't wait to do that. I didn't get any of the Series 21 minifigures because I'm actually not a huge minifigure collector, and I didn't really want to spend $180 on getting a whole box, nor did I want to sit there and feel them up because here in my province, there's a lot of restrictions and touching product is sort of frowned upon. So I didn't want to sit there for 10 minutes rummaging through all the bags and touching all the, the minifigures within the bags. Plus I'm not a huge minifigure collector. So it doesn't really matter. I don't really display them anywhere, but when we get the Brixie wall done, we're going to display them, but they'll be around. They'll be around. Like, like I, I got time to get those. If I want to get those, I can get them from, from uh, Lego group maybe and, and, uh, and feel the bags there. 
That's really about it for today. Just wanted to share my shopping experience. Round two for uh, the 2021 Lego sets available at Mastermind Toys. Most of this stuff will be available January 1st here uh, at your Lego store or on lego.com, assuming they have it in stock. Let me know what you guys think by commenting below. Remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for some more great stuff coming out in the near future. Thanks for watching as always. Bye for now.